I found a way down. I'm going in, the rest of you stay back. <clears throat> Captain, I compared the mold at the village with a sample from the bakers and... Uh, there's no sign of the genome editing we saw in the E-series. The stuff originated here. What? No, that's not right. I thought they got the mold from there. <clears throat> Warning shot? No? So we're going down there, huh? Guarding the Megamycete, huh? Bobo, I got a tough guy here. I'm gonna need backup. You're on the ground. There's an opening in the roof. Use it. with the locator. Give a guy a break. Ow. Nice. Thought so. You're still alive, seriously? Now. Just a minute. Yeah. Fuck. Oh, that was a waste. We lost our fire weapon. Ready when you are. I'll keep going. The rest of you stay above ground. Giant crystal mace. Okay, we are unable to craft. So if Miranda was the fake Mia, where's the real one? I doubt she saw any further use for her. I don't get any of this. How did Miranda even know Rose exists? A moldy little bird told her, maybe? We can figure that out later. Focus on the plan. 
found it. It's the Mega My Seed. So why are we not shooting it? I don't get it. Alpha the squad. I've located the Mega My Seed. So now we can end this mess after all. About damn time. And two explosives armed. There's enough there to blow the whole village sky high. Let's get out of here and blow the damn place. Not before I end Miranda. I'm not taking any more chances. I'm going in. Roger that. Standing by. Damn. Captain, I have eyes on Miranda at the ceremony site. Achievement unlocked. Keep your distance. Roots of the mind Do not matter. move until I give the order. I know it's too late now, but we really should have told Ethan the plan. There wasn't time. Exactly. And we didn't expect Miranda to act so soon. Even so, you should have told him. Yeah. That's true. Look, I love Ethan as a character, bro. And I really can't accept how he's just dead. Like that. Boop, got your heart. Come on, really? This must be Miranda's lab. Examine. Subject name, Salvatore Moreau. Cadu affinity, low. Brain function, surprisingly low. <laughs> Jesus. The Cadu has caused drastic changes to internal organs, transforming them into organs similar to fish-like gills and a swim bladder. Another subject with irregular cell division causing him to transform into a giant fish. The subject is unable to control this transformation. Too many defects, an unfit vessel for Eva. Okay, I guess that's Moreau. I'm guessing... This is... Oh. Subject name Alcina Dimitrescu. Cadu affinity, most favorable. Mm. Brain functions, normal. Regeneration rate is incredibly fast. The subject can heal any external wound within seconds. And grow her nails into claws in mere moments. Rapid regeneration also means an increased body size. No, due to her hereditary blood disease, the subject must ingest human flesh and blood on a regular basis to maintain regeneration properties? I suspect that if the subject's regeneration is not properly balanced, then she may mutate uncontrollably. An unfit vessel for Eva. Um, oh, this must be uh, Heisenberg. Subject name, Carl Heisenberg, Cadu affinity, incredibly favorable, brain functions normal. Has electric organs similar to the electric ray, Narca Haponica. These electrical organs are connected to the subject's nervous system. Can therefore pass and control electricity throughout the entire body, allowing control of magnetic, magnetic fields which is used to move metal. Splendid specimen, but still an unfit vessel for Eva. So this must be Donna next. Hey Donna, can I pick you up tomorrow? Subject name, Donna Beneviento. Cadu affinity, favorable. Brain functions, normal, although severe mental illness. Physically, she is no different from a regular human. However, she can secrete a signal-producing substance, which controls plants infected by the mutamycete. When humans absorb the pollen from a particular flower, she can cause them to have hallucinations. However, she is mentally underdeveloped and has divided her cadu among her dolls? In order to control them from a distance, an unfit vessel for Eva. Okay. Oh, this is the cadu, alright. Cadu! So they're using this to control the bioweapons. Wait, how did Heisenberg call them Kadu? The Kadu? Mm, the girl on the right must be Miranda. I'm not sure of those two other people. Dear Miranda, my deepest apologies for not meeting you in person. 
I would love nothing more than to visit your quaint village once more. However, I am incredibly busy. Then again, I suppose for an immortal woman such as yourself, you no longer remember this poor, half-dead medical student in the snow. I have always cherished the, the revelations I came to 15 years ago when I stayed in your village. I was inspired by your research. To think one could transform a human by infecting them with an organism. Positively visionary. I knew that with that knowledge, I could achieve my own vision for the next step in human evolution. Even after two world wars, and my humanity on the cusp of another, my conviction never wavered. Wait, so it's that long? I realized, however, through the many nights of intellectual talks you and I shared that your conviction differed from mine. You hope to bring back a single dead person while I aim to change the world. Your experiments on mold would not have aided me in my endeavor to achieve an exponential infection. I thought a virus would be more effective. This is why, my dear, I had to leave you. I still regret not telling you goodbye. My apologies for reminiscing. I actually have news that I thought might please you. I have found the key to evolution. The progenitor a virus found in Africa. I plan to start a company with friends and colleagues dedicated to the virus research. I will call it Umbrella. Just like the symbol in the cave that we spoke about. I am one step closer to the edge and I'm about to break. I need a little room to breathe. I am one step closer to making my vision a reality. I hope you will be able to achieve your goal someday too. You taught me so much and for that I will be forever in your debt. Sincerely, your lifelong student, Oswald E. Spencer! He was the guy who started the, the whole thing. Spencer, here. No way. the fuck? And I'm about to break! Uh, <laughs> oh my god! Show me your hands! <gasps> Umbrise, this is Alpha. Where is Miranda right now? God damn, it really is you. I'm glad you saved me. Why are you here? I was caught in Houston experiments. Wait, did you say Mia? Mia Winters? In the flesh. What's the situation up there? Kind of a war going on. Nothing we can't handle. Don't get distracted. Stick to the mission. I'm headed to the ceremony site. Wait. You can't leave me here. You promised, damn it. You said that you would keep us safe. We did everything that you asked. We moved over here, everything. And I didn't care. So long as we were together. So you tell me, where is my husband? Where is my daughter? Ethan is gone. I couldn't save him, but I can save Rose. Come on, it's not safe here after all. What do you mean he's gone? He's dead. I'm sorry, Mia, but we have to leave. We have to destroy this village. No, you're wrong. What? I tried to keep this a secret, but... You don't understand how special he is. What?
Ethan's alive? Yo! Yo! What's going on? <laughs> so it's there? It's cold. Where the fuck are we, Ethan? Nice car, Ethan. Oh my god, I'm so glad you're back, How dude. Did I get here? God, it's freezing. This shit in my body. Oh, it's Evelyn. Evelyn? How are you here? You're dead. Dead? I mean, Miranda. She... No. I still have to save Rose. Wrong? It wasn't Miranda. You were always dead. What are you saying? I can still... See? Miranda didn't kill you. You mean you didn't think it was weird? No matter how much you got hurt? Oh. Remember? Hi, Jack. Three years ago, the Baker House. Hi, Jack. You were murdered by Jack. You died there three years ago. That, that's that's impossible. No way. You shouldn't even be able to walk around. Quit messing with my head. You shouldn't be walking. Screw <laughs> you! Then what, what am I? We're mold. I, 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 I did all that. <laughs> Rose. Yeah. I... Now do you get it? <laughs> Your whole body is nothing but mold. Your family again. Family. Family. No. Rose. I have to save my daughter. You're already dead. Dead. <laughs> <laughs> I, I will save Rose. <sighs> I'll save you no matter what. Oof. You know, I always have I always have the suspicion because we can regenerate lost limbs. I didn't know that was 
like in universe that much, that much. Because I always knew, oh, of course, it's a Resident Evil game. We're bound to survive really fatal looking blows. But, damn. At last, he awakes. <laughs> what? Where am I? My carriage, Ethan. You were having a nightmare. Duke? Your battle with Heisenberg was a sight to see. But to think Miranda would show herself. Wait, who are you? How long have I been out? Not long till dawn. No, Duke, but I need a favor. Take me to Miranda. I assumed as much and I'm already on the way. We should arrive shortly. Thank you. No, who are you? But Ethan, are you sure of this? Your body is, well, falling apart. Yes. Foolish of me to ask. Speaking of foolish questions, who or what are you? Exactly. Even I can't quite answer that. We're here. I owe you one. Mr. Winters, I'm afraid you can't return to your old world any longer. Are you ready? What does that even mean? Yeah, I have to be. I gotta go. Wait, uh, Duke, can we talk first? Naturally. Ah, <sighs> because of all this commotion, I've lost an entire territory to transact in. Aw, <laughs> sorry, dude. Heisenberg's crystallized remains, what a twisted guy. Heisenberg's hammer? Yeah, let's sell that shit. Eh. Oh, the assemblage of life and machine. I can feel Lord Heisenberg's essence through it. Amat Victoria Koram. What does that mean? Ooh, more bang for our buck. Leave this to me. This may be our last meeting. Ooh. Be sure you have all you need. Man, it kind of makes me feel bad that you're saying that, man. I really like you, Duke. Uh-huh. I saw you eyeing that one. Yeah, we don't have much else. Your journey nears its end. How about some reckless spending to finish it off? <laughs> I, I mean, I guess you're right. Man, Duke, I'm gonna miss you, whatever Choose you are. Life. You're alive, please. Be well. Thank you, dude. Duke's always been with us all this time. Oh. Woo, okay. Oh, there's lots of items in here. Dude, we're, we're fine, but we're walking slowly. Oh, was that you? Hey, Orsi, thank you for all your services. I guess. Dude, Ethan, you gotta carry your ass. Come on. Can we check these first, just in case? Pretty sure we already looted the whole thing, but... Yeah. Exactly what I thought. How 
out of my way. Oh. Okay, now we are in decent speed. No, fuck you. No. I gotta keep going. Ah, oh, little Eva, my beautiful daughter.
Now let's try this thing. If I combine Rose with the middle oh, beast, shit. my daughter will be made manifest at last. I've waited a century, a century, all for this day. Shit. I can take any form I desire. Ow! Why do I what? Ouch. Surely you have no need for us now. So close to death. She's my goddamn daughter. You psycho. Oh, ow. Your life is over, Mr. Rivers. Why do you still fight? from that bitch you still stop <gasps> oh. Wait, no. Wait, no. Ethan. Ethan. Come on, Ethan. Come on, Ethan, wake up. Oh, no. Chris, Ethan. You did it. It's finished. I think we've finished each other. Ethan, we gotta move. Don't drop Rose. Guys, we need to help, guys. Keep moving, Ethan. There's a bomb in that thing that'll blow this whole village sky high. Oh. Hey, look at me. When I hit this trigger, we can't be anywhere near it. Ah, damn it. Mia's waiting for you. She's alive, you hear me? Alive. Mia. I'm so sorry. No, 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 no. Keep Rose safe. Hey, hey. Uh, hey. Uh, uh, uh. No, 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 you can't die now, dude. You Please just tell yourself. Now, come on, it's not that much further. Watch over her. Teach her to be strong. God damn. Goodbye. 
Goodbye, Rosemary. Ethan. I just realized I've never seen Ethan's face. Take us up now! going on where <laughs> what was that I told you to sit down <gasps> where is he Chris what have you done he's gone so we could all escape. I'm sorry. Captain. You need to see this. BSAA didn't send soldiers. This is a bioweapon. The hell were they thinking? What? Orders, Captain. Pick up the rest of the squad. Plot a course for BSAA Europe HQ. Someone's gotta pay. Start to finish, this was a superb game. The only thing I didn't like was how Ethan died. They made us care for Ethan for two games, bro. We've heard is sarcastic banter for two games. Now, now we've never seen his face, but I kind of feel like I'm Ethan. I, I mean, I guess it lends to us never seeing his face, and Ethan doesn't have much personality besides the witty one-liners and uh, relatable thoughts and he was just single-minded he he tried to save Rose as much as he can 
and I, I don't know, man. I just kind of feel like they killed me. Other than that, I think this is one of the best survival horror games I've ever played. In a decade. In a decade. Gifts we gave, but more you took, she snarled. So more, in turn, is due. In a blink, the girl was trapped inside a mirror. Her parents, though, had searched all day and at last arrived. With rampant rage, father fought the witch, while mother's loving touch shattered the dark enchantment. But the witch was strong, and father yelled, Save our daughter! So mother bore their child to safety as the forest was consumed. Even now, the burnt forest is a grim reminder of father's sacrifice. To this day, any child who stares too long into the charred wasteland will be haunted by nightmares of getting lost while picking berries. Hello, Monty. Okay, look. So, for those who have never seen a Resident Evil game before, Chris has always been there, starting from the first Resident Evil. So, I am very familiar with Chris Redfield, and I still get the references about him like Chris is a boulder punching son of a bitch or whatever and I care for him as a separate a separate entity but I'm not sure what to feel now that now that I'm not playing Ethan I mean, I guess what will happen next is we're going to play as either Mia or Rose. But... I really think they missed a lot by killing Ethan there. Also... Heisenberg's fight. I wish we could have gotten more of his human form. This is usually an issue I have with games where there are super forms or transformations. Because Carl Heisenberg was cool as fuck. He had those round glasses and he had magnetism, bro. Which is unheard of in Resident Evil. And he carried this big ass hammer like it's nothing. I think they really missed a mark on Heisenberg there. And how I was actually excited that we could have a chance to battle with Heisenberg. But then it didn't really happen. And then. There was promise that we could battle with Chris, basing on Chris's dialogue himself, and um, you know the the shot on the head uh, towards Miranda. I thought we were going to fight with Chris, but that didn't happen as well. Then in the end, the big ass mute on my seat was like. Uh, looming towards us and I thought we were like oh yes we will we are going to have one more fight with Chris but it no it didn't happen so uh, yeah I guess there are really a lot of missed marks on this 
other than that, it is a fantastic game. I think there's a bit too much ammo, which uh, enabled me to just shoot everything on site, even though we've seen certain uh, segments like the where you can knife the the lights on the uh, the iron doors. From what I can see, it was supposed to be like a panic fight or a panic run, but you know, I think us on a sniper rifle is too powerful. So uh, other, other than that, what else? Yeah, I think, uh, I think it was a really good game. Oh, and uh, Mother Miranda as well. I mean, no, 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 no. Um, who was that? Alcina Dimitrescu. They underutilized him, uh, her. She was like on the forefront of the marketing of Resident Evil 8. Lots of people simped for uh, Alcina Dimitrescu. But then suddenly she transforms into this winged creature. And we just kind of kill her. And then she's dead as the first boss of Resident Evil 8. I mean, come on, man. We could have gotten a lot more from Alcina Dimitrescu. Uh, Donna and Moreau were... more or less the jobbers. Like, yeah, we needed two other bosses, so let's shoehorn them in. But otherwise, they were also really interesting characters. Oh, and just like that. Um, just as I finished my analysis of the, the bosses. The game... Oh. Think the little boy will be able to touch the moon? Nobody can touch the moon, it's too far away. Wait, what if he has a rocket ship? Uh, okay, then he can touch it, but it'd be very, very cold. You were being silly. I don't <laughs> think the moon feels like I don't think it Dad, happy birthday. Sorry I missed last week. I have a lot of tests coming up. You know how it is. <laughs> Talk of the goddamn devil. Duty calls. I love you. Bye, Ethan. Yeah, I found her. Where else? Today of all days. <clears throat> we have a situation. You're needed, <laughs> Evelyn. Don't you ever call me that again. Whoa, whoa, it's just a joke, Rose. I can show you things even Chris doesn't know I can do. Stand down. I can handle it. She's just a kid. <sighs> Way to keep it together, Rose. You're a lot like him, you know? I know.
Bye, Ethan. What happened? The father's story is now done. Are we supposed to click? Oh, achievement unlocked great dad and achievement unlocked best dad ever. Completion time 12 hours. Damn, boy. Um, challenges and extra content shop complete challenges listed in the challenges menu in order to receive completion points CP <laughs> CP can be exchanged for a variety of bonuses in the extra content shop new game mode, weapons, concept art figures so. the following movies have been added to the movies in the bonuses menu village of shadows full version creating the village of shadows ooh Level design of Resident Evil Village, the visual development of Resident Evil Village, the visual production. Uh, mm -hmm. You can now get the following weapon from the extra content shop for finishing the main story. I don't know what that is. Okay, challenge challenge complete. You have completed the following challenges. Completion points. CP. Can be used to purchase items in the extra content shop in the bonus, bonus menu. Not liking this. Four lords. That sucked. Got no strings. Fish out of water. Up yours. I don't know what that is. Temporary measures. Iron giant down. The root of the matter. Great dad. Best dad ever. Crafter. Patron. Petty thief. <laughs> Alright. Overwrite is completed data. When you load the complete data, some things will carry over from your completed game. Yeah, sure. Completed data, su save successful. And there you go. We have finished the main... Um... Ooh. And now... And now the main menu is back to this. It was burning before. Aight, aight. Ooh, okay. Ooh. So we can play Shadows of Rose next time and... Ooh, what's this? Change Rose's appearance. Why? Play Shadows of Rose from the beginning. And then we can also play The Mercenaries Additional Orders. Wait, why did you save? Who's that? Is that Ethan? Why can we never see Ethan's goddamn face, man? Alright, so... We can see more of uh, Resident Evil Village. Uh... I guess after we finish the Rose DLC and then after that, we are going to play Resident Evil 4 which has already been released as of now. And I still haven't gotten to playing it. And uh... Bip, bip, bip. Thank you for sticking with me for the longest time, man. So uh, what can I say? See you guys. This was a very great game and I am honored to be playing this game and somehow some people are watching this. So uh, like, comment, subscribe, ring the notification bell or whatever, whatever that shit. Uh, thank you and let's see each other in the Shadows of Rose DLC. See ya.